What's up, folks? <coughs> this is Omar Hosea. For real. Got that you with another deep thought that just come to mind as I'm walking past to school, those projects right there, and the little projects at the top of the hill. You know, went home, boy. You know, my old stop and grounds and stuff. I still say it's my stop and grounds. I just don't stop for what I used to stop for. You know what I mean? <laughs> I stop. I stop for a real cause. We walk for a real purpose. But uh, noticing, right? Uh, a Mexus. They used to be this called. This one used to be called a Mexus when the Moors were here. Uh, and so we was already here, right? This is my land right here. This is my inheritance right here. I'm from the earth because I am Adam. And I, I, just, I just couldn't figure out why do I have to pay you, pay, why do we have to pay corporate America to walk this earth? When I was born from this earth, the earth is mine, and I ain't got to pay you. <laughs> To walk these streets, to walk on this earth. Granted, you paved the streets, but you paved the streets in blood. And because I don't walk in the blood that you like to drink, I'm not incurred by your sin. We're not incurred by their sin, Israel, Ishmael. So now I'm thinking about all the homelessness is in our in my community right now here in Homewood, right here, just in Homewood alone. You know what I mean? And they got my brothers on the corner. They still doing the same thing. Everybody's still doing the same. What they do, same language, same knowledge, the same whatever. But I, but I noticed this though, for real, for I, I, I really that they tell us because of our, our our criminal background, or because of our criminal nature, or because of these criminal activities, what we've done in the past, that you groomed us from when we were babies. And when I say you whore, I'm talking about America. You, you bred these babies out your motherfucking belly. And now you're going to try to tell the children that from the land that they were born from, that they have to bow down and forsake their nature to live in an apartment building controlled by corporate America. Y'all call them projects. And y'all created these projects on our land to put us in and then separate our families. And guess what? We'll make it so bad. We bought into it. Old dirty bastard, he pulled up his limo into the projects and said, Look, you can live in the projects and still ride nice. Rest in peace, ODB. But that was a fucked up picture you gave us. I thought it was cool myself. I'm purging myself of this stuff too while I'm talking to you. Uh, wherever you may be in your neighborhood, man, you come around with Bentleys and you come around like you this and this and that, like you, I'm um, going back to Harlem. That's a fucking project. That is a trap, that's a concentration camp that you're partying in and you're killing people for talking about my buck. <laughs> and the funny thing is, the police have a right to lock you up and take your guns because it's not even your fucking project. Hey. What's up, folks? Oh, uh, I'm... I'm I'm low percent right now on that for loose. I might be beautiful on my way to church and stuff. Do my do my my. Per no, no, it's called I don't have a beautiful. If I had that, give it to you. Anyway, I ain't saying what you need or what you don't need it for. I don't have it to give it to you. That's all. How you been, sweetie? I'm all I'm all right. Why don't you walk up to the thing, man? Come do come do a prayer or something real quick. You might your day might change. It might. I believe it will. That's where I go. But, uh, yeah, think about that, uh, folks. When you're out here, how you doing, sister?
All right. Uh, when you're out here, think about that. Think about that. Got them projects, man. Stop glorifying them projects because they built the projects to put you in like a prison to prisoners. You better think about that while y'all shooting your horns, smoking your weed. Come on, I'm glad to go back. I'm glad to go back to my hood. I'm glad to go back to my projects. What's up, love boy? How you doing, sonny? Look good, man. But you could look better. That's why we love you. <laughs> I'm here, baby. Uh, so yeah. We love you too, man. All right, love one. Uh, so, and so, and see, that's that's what happens when you come back to the hood too. Who you want to be? You know, when you tell the truth, you get the truth, man, and you die by the truth. There is no death in honor, but there is one in honor, dishonor. This is Homo Omar Hosea saying peace. Black Ink Production, another spark moment. I'm out.